Hey, uh, Vinyl Community, what's up? Uh, this is a quick update of my newly purchased vinyl stuff. Um, starting off maybe with that stuff that you're listening to in the background, it's the wonderful Dentel EP. This is the dream of Evan and Chen, uh, 2001, I think, on Plug Research, a Los, Angel Los Angeles-based uh, label. And Dantel is, of course, Jimmy Tamborello, one half of the Postal Service. He had a beautiful album on Pampa Records last year, by the way. Okay, I showed this on the Facebook page. It is the soundtrack for I'm Not There. Uh, Bob Dylan tracks um, 33, I guess. Uh, the thing that really sucks about this one is it was sealed when I bought this from eBay. But when I pulled the records out of the original sleeves, which I have here, uh, the glue from the sleeves on the side stick to the records. And now I don't know how to get it off properly so that I do not destroy the records. If you have any recommendation how I could do this, I only can listen to one of those four LPs because um, all other records are glued. Okay, I think I, th I showed this. This is my new Stevie Wonder uh, music of my mind. It's kind of warped, but it works perfectly. This is Nick Drake's Brighter Later. Uh, it's the Back to Black edition, the non-box uh, set. Uh, it is beautiful. The cover is beautiful. It has this inner sleeve. I will talk about this in a second. Um, it sounds beautiful, uh, and it was only 11 pounds plus shipping. So it was pretty great, <clears throat> and I love it. I bought this for five euros last week. It's a Nina Simone compilation on RCA Records. It features some pretty interesting songs that I never heard of uh, uh, that she did them. Uh, Mr. Bojangles, I Shall Be Released by Bob Dylan, of course. Uh, I Can't See Nobody to Love Somebody, um, Blues for Mama, and so on. It's pretty cool, it's okay especially for five bucks. Love it. Um, I showed this. Uh, it's German experimental instrumental hip-hop. Double LP. It's a reissue. Uh, this was originally released, I guess, two or three years ago. Flacco is the artist. Uh, Mezaktet Extended. Very good. Um, found this. I, I said it, uh, 50 cents, uh, euro cents. It's a compilation, Chris Isaac, Wicked Game, I love it. I, I, I never, I mean, I, I knew the song back from the day, uh, Wicked Game, of course, and it features some more really great tracks, Heart Full of Soul, Blue Spanish Sky, Blue Hotel, and the instrumental version of Wicked Game, awesome. Then I saw a video of my good friend uh, Guillaume uh, here on, um, YouTube and he talked about his favorite album and this is Talk Talks Spirit of Eden and I have this or I had this on CD for a couple of years and I loved it and then uh, immediately after I saw that video I went um, on eBay and found this copy and it's really nice in really nice condition it's an OG it's awesome 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 stuff Okay, um, kind of a, a contrast program is this one. Guns N' Roses, I found it for 10 bucks. It's the original band cover, original inner sleeve um, in near mint condition. Um, it's cool to have it, not more. Okay, then I talked about Pop Market uh, last time. Last time I waited uh, three months for my pop market uh, package this time i waited three days and it contains this 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 and this record by outcast from atlanta i love them those are my four favorite records i didn't like idlewild too much um and the first one i really don't know um these are represses of course but they sound awesome Beautiful. It's just the price was so good. I have some more stuff on order from Pop Market. Uh, two Neil Young Live LPs and the uh, and the Black Keys uh, vinyl bundle. I'm very excited on that one. 
Then, um, I just bought it half an hour ago, and I love this record to death. It's the John Coltrane and Johnny Hartman Impulse album, and it's the, oops, here, it's the Speaker's Corner Edition. Um, and I had to buy the Spears Corner Edition because I love this so much. It is kind of expensive, 27 euros. Even more expensive is this shit here. It's the MoFi Master Sleeves, 50 pieces. 50 record sleeves for, it says here, 30 euros. I hope to get them uh, a little cheaper. If you, have a, uh, if you have a chance to get them cheaper in Europe, please let me know. Uh, that's it for now. Um, there's a lot of stuff coming in the next two weeks, so I think, or I hope, I can do another uh, quick update in a couple of days. So, take care. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.